car sleepover challenge. We're all gonna have different cars. We have to spend the entire day and night in while completing challenges throughout the day. Let's go see what vehicle we get. Here in my garage, uh, Justin, you drop first. It would be my pleasure. Wow. 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 That was the, that skipped the whole board. <laughs> that was crazy. Wait, what'd I get? The, the Reviathan. The Reviathan. I've never driven one of these cars yet. Electric truck. This is actually gonna be good because I have space in the back. Enough space to room over. It's a good one for a sleepover. Oh yeah. You get a camping, like something uh -huh. like that. Oh man. I did good. I gotta get to the piston cup. Whoa! Well, what are you doing? Nothing. You got big van. Big van. That's I don't the know. Best. Is it the best? Big van equals roomy. Well, that's true. Big van for big boy. I'll take that. That's good. Okay. Cha-chan. <laughs> Never driven that before. All right, let's go get in our vehicles. But first, we have to show you something. Right behind this sheet. We are standing on the bridge of this giant spaceship that we built. We're making a movie when we hit 8 million subscribers, so hit subscribe if you haven't yet. And this summer, we're actually gonna be doing a movie tour where you can come and watch the movie with us. Captain, we're coming in hot. Fire! Subscribe! Right, let's get to the cars. Well, here we are guys, the Rivian. I've been wanting to drive this truck ever since I saw it first announced on the internet. Let me just say, this is pretty sweet. A fully electric truck. I think I'm gonna have no problem in this overnight. How do I open door? A Ferrari. This thing is so low to the ground. I'm used to driving like a truck and bigger vehicles. Is this back all the way? Oh. I mean, the Ferrari obviously is a sick car, but I'm a taller guy. I don't know how I'm gonna spend the night in here. <laughs> I'll start it up for you guys. How do you open this? Is the key? Dad, come it! Well, this is the big van. Okay. Oh, look at the speaker system. This is pretty spacious. There's a whole back row that's pretty spacious. And so I think with some supplies, I can make this a pretty nice place to sleep. At first, I was a little disappointed that I got a van. Yeah, I can definitely work with this. I think the sports car is obviously way cooler to drive around, but in terms of actually having a sleepover, spending the night, this thing is a winner for sure. And it works. Oh, this is so cool. The entire roof is basically a sunroof. I love it already. So like I said, I've never driven an electric truck before. I have driven Tesla, but this is a whole different vibe. I love the interior in here. You got custom cool seats, leather. It's just so quiet. The car is apparently already on. And all I gotta do is buckle up and move this knob, I guess. And now I just gotta go. Oh, this is gonna be nuts. Very low to the ground. I know, right? And uh, Drew's gonna be, I don't know what the right word is. I can't think of sentences in here. Drew's gonna be hopping between all the different cars to get shots, but, oh gosh, is this auto? Hope so. I'm driving, guys, I'm driving. Dang. race car driver. Oh, this is sick. Whoa. This car is very unique. It's a street legal race car. There's only like three of them in the world. And this car is worth about $300,000. I have like everything. I might have to invest in some earplugs. <laughs> so far, this truck is way better than I expected. I was already excited to drive it, but the more I drive it on the road, the better it gets. It's extremely comfortable. Everything works smoothly. I'm so glad I got this. I was actually jealous that Andrew got the Ferrari. I mean, who wouldn't want to drive that? Whoa! Oh, this thing feels like, it does feel like the Batmobile. But realizing if you got the Ferrari, 
there's not much room to, to go anywhere. You're kind of just stuck. Isaac and myself walked away with pretty good vehicles. All right, before the challenge actually starts, we're gonna stop off at Walmart and get a few supplies before. Ow! Oh, you little vet. Oh, ow. ow! First things up, I'm getting a pillow and a blanket. Like I said, I don't know how I'm gonna be able to spend the night in this thing. Gotta make it as comfy as possible. Oh, that's nice. That's a good one. I have a feeling that my van is going to stay pretty warm. And so, are you okay? My ears still hurt. From what? Ferrari's so loud. But there are a few things I'm looking for. The most amazing blanket, the most amazing pillow, and the most amazing game. It's gonna be hard because we're at Walmart, but I'm gonna look. You can't hurt me. I have enough space to host some sporting events, I think. I'm getting these, and tonight at midnight, I'm gonna make you two box. Me, me and you? Yep. In your vehicle? In in my vehicle, yeah. That implies we're gonna have to like climb around because once we get in our vehicles after we're done shopping, you can't get out. Since my car doesn't have a lot of room, I'm trying to think if there's any activities that would even work inside the Ferrari. So far, I'm not having much luck. It may just be sort of a... <laughs> The most luxurious pillows. I could either go with the cooling one, which I actually like the thinner memory foam pillows, or like sleeping on air pillow. This one's 40, this one's 30, but the cooling pillow might be better. Yes, I'm gonna sleep like a king tonight. I got a mascot for my vehicle. It's a fuggler. <laughs> what? What it's, is that? It's a funny, ugly monster, a fuggler. And this is my Fortnite skin. So we have a little group of friends that has all the Ninja Turtles in Fortnite. I'm Donatello. I'm Michael Angle and Jill. Uh, it must be nice to be invited. Well, do you have a turtle? No. Then you, you can't play. Tell me. Sorry. For my party lights tonight, I'm getting glow sticks, but not these dumb, horrendous glow sticks that Walmart wants to sell. 20 bucks, you get 200 pieces. Yay. These are the worst glow sticks ever. But if you go to the camping section, that's where the luxurious glow sticks are. So there's a good hack for you guys. I've actually learned that that thing in the ceiling of my van is a TV that comes down and I can put DVDs in there, real life DVDs. Remember those? I found this and uh, you know, when you're like doing a sleepover with the boys, you kind of sometimes want to watch a little scary movie, getting the vibes. So this- Is that, is that scary? I mean, w wouldn't that be pretty scary? <laughs> <laughs> guys. The brand new Mr. Beast Feastables bar. These ones look better. The peanut butter? Oh yeah, let me try one of those. Are they good? I'm gonna try one of each. No, no, no you can't have to buy it. Isaac, this isn't freaking England, you moron. It's good. I'm gonna buy it. Yeah, but you opened it before buying it. If Isaac does not come back to check out with the candy bar he opened, I'm calling the cops on him. And then the, the vehicle you have to stay in for the next 24 hours is the cop car? Yes, is the cop car. <laughs> Isaac, where'd the wrapper go? What rapper? Exactly. What are you talking about? Drew, we were right. You were, oh, I was, I was closer I, to We were zero. both right though. You made predictions? I did it. It's right here, you nuts. Oh, you. I'm not a thief anymore. Well, where is it now? Thief. I'm not a thief anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a thief anymore. Uh, quick disclaimer, guys. Don't eat stuff while you're in the store. It's Unless not, you're in England. That's, that's what not they obvious. do. That's not what they do in England. All right, guys. We have to get in our cars. And once we do, we can't get out. So load up your gear and let the adventure begin. Actually, ow, oops. I thought the trunk was gonna be a big bonus, but I don't know how to get in the trunk once I get in the car. It's impossible. Oh. Now, unfortunately, my car has zero trunk space, but everything I buy has to go on Drew's lap. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> uh, just throw it on top of the engine, it'll be fine. Yeah, look at that, that's good, right? Well, I mean, there's a little storage space right here, right in between the seat. Yes. We, on the other hand, have absolutely zero space problems. <laughs> what? Space problems. <laughs> For some reason, I thought I said something wrong, but I didn't. It just sounds funny. Let me load up all my snacks and get on the road. We're about to get in the vehicles. No getting out. And I think the first thing on our checklist, we're all on the same page, lunch. That's oh, right. Yeah, please. Good luck, especially you. Travel safe. I am foreseeing my first problem with this van is that it's tall. And so going through drive throughs might be tricky. So what I'm gonna do is follow Andrew in the sports car. Oh my. The best part about my vehicle, I do not have to do anything to turn it on. I just sit down and it's already on. It doesn't make any sounds either. So. Seriously? <laughs> Are you trying to make us deaf? I'm just trying to start my car, man. 
Gosh. failure, ABS systems, manifesto failure, lamp failure, not cal calibrated suspension failure, airbag failure, EBP failure, and we're ready to go. I don't know if Rick wants that on camera. Oh. Unless it's funny because it's modded, which means nothing is hooked up. Where are you going for lunch? I'm following Andrew. Okay. Oh, I gotta go. Yeah, you're gonna have to keep up. Good luck. Bye. Right now I am on my way to my first drive-through for lunch today. And lunch is gonna be especially delicious. I'm gonna put it in sport mode soon and give it full power blast for you guys. Just to see how fast this thing goes. Someone's looking? Someone's looking right at me. thing I'm worried about driving behind Andrew is that I might rear end him and that would be probably the worst thing I could ever do. So far this truck is way better than I expected. I was already excited to drive it but the more I drive it on the road the better it gets. It's extremely comfortable. Everything works smoothly. I'm so glad I got this. Oh, there we go. That's why I'm so hot in here. This thing was on max heat. Whoa it's getting really hot. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa turn it off. Dude, oh, I don't turn know it how. Off. Turn it off. Ah. Oh my gosh dude, I can't hear my own thoughts. No, my brain's like rattling. You know? Okay, Isaac wants to race. Chipotle for lunch. And this Chipotle has a drive through so it makes everything better. Hi, Hi what's I'm the name on there? Justin. Perfect. And what did you want for that drink? Can I have the watermelon limeade? Absolutely. Let me go grab that for you. All right, thanks. Got the bag, guys. I'm so hungry and so happy. Put that right there, guys. There we go. Oh, yeah. I feel pretty luxurious driving this truck. I think sleeping in here is going to be no problem as well. I've got the back seat, or I got the tunnel. I got options. This is a, I feel like a fairly rare thing. That's a Panda Express for the drive through So that's what's for lunch. I'm pumped. I love Panda. I don't think I'm gonna make it. <clears throat> Actually, maybe I will. Oh, I think I'm good, right guys? I think it's not gonna make it. Uh oh. 10 foot? There's no way he makes that. Oh no, is he trying it? No, no. Oh no. Yes, I made it. Guys, that was the, pretty much the only problem I had, and it's not even a problem. This van is definitely the best. Hey, could I do a plate, please, with orange chicken and uh, just the white rice, please? What are the odds when I'm sitting there, the car is just so loud that she's like, I can't hear you. Should I rev it? My ear? I'm trying, I want orange chicken. <laughs> Remember, it's a little wide on the side, so we don't get too close. It just feels so awkward. Like in this super Ferrari car. How, how, how hungry am I? <laughs> Can I do a uh, plate with the honey sesame chicken, orange chicken, and noodles? I'm sorry, can you repeat that one more time? I do it. Can I get a plate with honey sesame chicken, orange chicken, and noodles? Alright, anything else? That's it. I knew you would be able to hear me. <laughs> Let's see what we got for lunch today, guys. A chicken queso burrito. How could you go wrong? How could this day get any better? Let's see how far back we can recline. I gotta say, this is my kind of challenge. It is crazy that the person who won a literal Ferrari is actually in the worst position for this challenge. No space to do anything, cramped up in there. Feels good to be on top for once. I've never been like below the window before. Thanks. Can I get two? Cups? Can I get uh, two water cups? I mean, the rest of the storage has been. Oh wait, I gotta put Donnie up here in the storage bin. I think I see you guys somewhere. On YouTube? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Thanks. See ya. 
I'm really excited for tonight because I'm looking forward to seeing what kind of things we get up to when all of us can't leave our cars. Now here comes Andrew. Comfortable. If back here is my bed and I don't like it, come up to the front seat and vibe out. I'm sorry that you're not here to physically experience this vehicle. I'm doing my best to just be in the moment and express my gratitude and enjoyment. Oh, I don't want to fall asleep. Let's go back. Ever since the new Mr. Beast bars came out, I've been desperate to try a bite. Here we go. This is the peanut butter one. This is the almond flavor. Mmm! Mmm! This is actually insanely, insanely good. good! What the heck? Wow! Um, I highly recommend the upgraded flavor. That was so much better than the first edition. Wow! wow. I know it's nice to have like the car running for certain things like AC, music. You don't really have any of those things. Except hearing oh, loss. This thing is so sick. Oh, it's, thanks. Is it yours? No, no, not mine, <laughs> unfortunately. But it's pretty cool. This thing's sick, dude. Yeah, appreciate it. Wait, hey, maybe that's one. You're the only one who's gotten a car compliment, as far as we know. Oh, you're right. A side quest. All right, I'm gonna challenge Isaac. Isaac, what? I challenge you to get a compliment from someone else about your car. He wasn't talking about your car. Hey, do you like my car? Yours? This one's mine. <laughs> you can't. No, he's my compliment guy. You gotta find your own. Don't stop believing! Guys, I, there's actually no music going on there. That was edited in by our editors with movie magic. That's actually how they do the movies as well. Because, I don't know. This is only the beginning of our epic adventure, guys. My guy who just gave the car a compliment, I'm gonna give him a little rev, you know, just to put it neutral. All right, here we go. Dude, he freaking loved that. He's pumped. Yeah, see ya. Now it's time for the moment I've been waiting for, to put the truck into sport mode and see how powerful it is. Sport mode is activated. I do have my stuff in the trunk, so hopefully it just doesn't fly out because of how fast I'm going. Just do a quick little test. Oh, jeez. Dude, what? <laughs> Dude, I'm already going 60. How is that possible? I feel like an astronaut. I never thought a truck would be that powerful. I'm almost certain my truck goes faster than the Ferrari Andrew's driving. Goodness, I'm so hungry. Do not want to make a mess. Don't fail. Don't worry. I'm really good at eating. This car is the best. I can drop stuff everywhere. Bing. <laughs> Nobody cares. Crazy guy. Who let him drive, you know? Mmm, this is so good. Best panda you ever had. Man, this is like the second best panda I ever had. I'm already feeling pretty tired, so I feel like a nice pick-me-up will make this adventure even better. My drink of choice, I got a peanut butter mocha ice latte. This is so good. I've never had it before. Just our one of our local coffee drive through service. It's gotta be my favorite latte. So good. I actually don't know how to go backwards. Oh, <laughs> is that the right button? I don't know. Um, okay, neutral, and then reverse. Ah, yeah, it's just that easy. You know, day one of being a Ferrari owner, it's been pretty cool. I want to take a curve like kind of hard, you know? Oh yeah. Like this next one. to show you a quick speed blast. Kind of straight away in front of me. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh, that is the craziest feeling ever. This feels like a roller coaster. Oh man, this will never get old. You guys are not gonna believe this, but this 
dang snowstorm came out of nowhere and it's supposed to snow like the rest of the day I can barely drive this <laughs> this thing is not meant for the snow okay, I'm just gonna park here all of this happened in like the last 30 minutes to an hour we're just driving around no problems and then all of a sudden snowstorm I have two options I can sit here in the snowstorm and not go anywhere in the middle of the Walmart parking lot or I can call Isaac and see if I can sneak onto his van and we can continue the video that way. Because as much fun as this car is, I really don't, I don't want to just sit here the rest of the video. I'm going to call Isaac. What's that? What's that sound? Oh, uh, hey, you know how it's like snowing all of a sudden? Yeah. Um, yeah, my race car can't go anywhere now. I literally can't drive. It's just spinning out and like the, the roads are so wet. There's no traction. I'm stuck here in the Walmart parking lot. I was wondering if, if you pulled up close enough to the car, I might be able to jump onto your van and we could do a sleepover in your car. Oh, a sleepover buddy? Yeah, I think that might be more fun than me sitting in Walmart parking lot. <laughs> Yeah, I'll come over there. I'm just sitting here in the Ferrari and the snowstorm. <laughs> hey, okay, bye. All right, I'm here to pick up Andrew. Ugh. Hey. Hey. I'm trying to think how I can get into your car without getting out of my car. I'll hold you. Okay. First things, I'm gonna give you all my supplies. Okay. Oh, dude, it's so what a miserable day. How did this happen, dude? It was like so nice, like an hour ago. That's what we're eating. It's fresh in the sunny parking lot. This always happens in Colorado. And I know everyone watches it. It's going to be like, why didn't you check the weather? This just happens. This just happens. <laughs> oh! oh! This little stool came with this van. I actually don't know what it's for in real life, but uh, <laughs> since it's a piece of my van, it still counts as a car. Okay. Okay, get in, boy. That actually might be super helpful. I don't know how you're gonna do this. Just watch and learn. You ever snuck out of a Ferrari before in a snowstorm? <laughs> there we go. Okay. Are you holding? Yes. How strong are you? I'm pretty dang strong. Okay. Oh, we've done it. Quick, get to school. Since I have you here, could you pass me a Dr. Pepper? You can just uh, be my snack guy. Oh, yes. Thanks, Butler Andrew. I I love it in here. It, ah, it's yeah. just not as fast as my car. Was this just an excuse so you could have a better night? Look, I had every intention of sleeping in the Ferrari. I just don't want to spend the rest of the day in a snowstorm in the Walmart parking lot. Well, too bad, huh? Yeah, too bad for you, I guess, huh? <laughs> We're not even playing rock, paper, scissors for who, bed get, who gets bed. It's obviously mine. And you get whatever's left. I suppose that's fair. <laughs> yeah, I want to sit in the front, not back here as your chauffeur. It's time I call Andrew to see where he is and meet up. Hello? Where are you? Uh, we just parked in the parking lot. Are you close to the rock climbing? I think. Send me the coordinates and I'll meet you there. Okay, well, we have something to tell you. Oh, all right. All right, see you soon. Are you kidding me? Kidding me? Gosh! <laughs> what was that? What happened? It was more than I was expecting. It's diet, so it's not sticky. Don't worry. Oh, that's how that works? Yeah. I don't know about that. It is, I promise. You've tested it. I actually have, yeah. Gosh, I didn't want that in my hair. <laughs> but now you smell so sweet and okay. yummy. It's the sweet one. Now drive. Where are we going? We're already here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> They're, they're coming to us. Looks like you guys are together. Yeah, so? What happened to your wonderful car? Look, sports car failed in the snow, okay? Yeah, look how snowy it is outside. We have a dare for you. You have to go through a drive-thru, order an ice cream cone, and grab it upside down, and take a bite from the... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bringing me back to the prank roots, that should be no problem. Well, I have a dare for you then. You and Isaac, since you're together, have to go through the same drive through 10 times in a row, ordering the exact same thing every time. 10 times? That's, that's so many times. 10 times. You have to say the same thing. Doesn't matter what it is, we can order whatever we want. Yeah. 
Well, good luck with the ice cream, Mr. Pranks. Watch and learn. Ah, uh, what are the odds their ice cream machine's out of commission? Probably high. And what can I get for you? Can I get a, a water and an ice cream cone, please? Anything else for that? No, thanks. I have yeah. a cone here for you. Uh, one second for the water. Yeah, thanks. No, it's fine. Oh, okay. Yep. Yeah. Sorry about that, man. Nah, no worries. I don't want to eat the paper. Here's that large water for you. Cool. Thanks, brother. You guys have a good day. Yep. Wrap. <laughs> why is this melting so fast? <laughs> oh my god. Ah! <laughs> Wait, why, uh, why are you driving away? I don't know. Where am I going? <laughs> Drew! Uh, can I do uh, one cheesy roll up with extra cheese and a side of beans, please? What else can I get for you? That'll do it. Thank you. 171 today. Thank you. That's a good price. Oh, dude. We're up on that curb. We need to keep count of how many. Of well, they're going to give us a bag each time, right? Oh, yeah. I guess so we can just count the roll ups. <laughs> <laughs> Um, cheesy roll up with extra cheese and a side of beans. Dude, it's gonna take us all evening. <laughs> I guess this is dinner though. This is dinner? I was hoping for something else. <laughs> 171. Thank you. Did you need any tart packets? Uh, just a Diablo, please. Thank you so much. The anxiety just yeah. set in. That was only number one, and I'm thinking of how annoyed they're gonna be. I don't know why, but just the, yeah, can I get Diablo sauce? Is just like you're the extra on top. <laughs> Dude, you're on the curb again! <laughs> okay, that's one of ten. Nine more cheesy roll-ups to go. I'm not going back to McDonald's to get napkins, so I'm going to Jimmy John's. Hi, we'll get an Italian nightclub regular and a ton of napkins. I spilled ice cream on my pants. I got you. All right. <laughs> what a legend. <laughs> that guy. <laughs> ice cream on my pants, he's like, I got you. I know, he has got me. Can we get those napkins? Oh, let's oh, go. Yes, sir, thank you. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> okay, that's one of 10. Nine more cheesy roll-ups to go. Should I be eating the last, the, the last one as I'm going back again? <laughs> always has it in your mouth. And then we have to order the same way. Good night, dude! <laughs> What's with the curb? There's no way you're gonna avoid it. Hey, could I please do a cheesy roll-up? <laughs> Sorry, go ahead. Uh, could I do a cheesy roll-up with extra cheese and a side of beans, please? A cheesy roll-up with, with extra cheese and a side of bread sauce, you said? A side of beans, please. Oh, a side of beans. Uh, that'll do it. Thank you. It was a different person this time. I know, but this is gonna be the same girl at the, at the register. And you're just gonna be eating a cheesy roll. <laughs> yes. I gotta be eating the last one. Mm, these are so good. <laughs> this was worth it for napkins, even though I've pretty much just ate lunch. Whatever. <laughs> Wait, where are you where going? Holy heck! Hey. Thank you. Thank you. The price different. Yeah, it's more. It was more expensive this time. Keep that in mind. <laughs> That's a whole dollar more. <laughs> Thank you. <clears throat> this poor guy, dude. The last girl seemed like a, if you'd get annoyed. This poor guy feels like he's just gonna be so confused. All right, two down, eight to go. How are we feeling? So far, it's okay. There's been two different people each time. And but, two different prices. Yeah, what's up with that? What we can talk about, how can we help you today? Uh, one cheesy roll up with extra cheese, please. And then a side of beans as well. That'll do it, thank you. Any uh, soft packets? Uh, some Diablo, please. I right, well, take them down. The reason I chose this specific item as well is because I can easily pound down up to 10 cheesy roll-ups. So with Andrew's help, we're not actually going to be wasting any of the food. Yeah, I might have one. <laughs> I could easily pound down nine cheesy roll-ups. I'll probably have a light dinner since I just had an, another basically meal. I have a dessert. Tropical Punch beverage. 236. Thank you, man. Thank you. Number three. Great work. Uh, I bet the chef is going to be saying, yeah, I never made this many cheesy roll-ups ever. <laughs> well, that's not true. I've been here before. <laughs> <laughs> this was not too sus. We're going to switch, and Andrew's going to do some of it. You just make it like, ow! <laughs> <laughs> Man, you uh, wailed that skin. Uh, <laughs> well, that hurt. Hi, right, can I just get a uh, cheesy roll-up with extra cheese and a side of beans? Anything else? Well, that's it. Thanks. Thank can, I, uh, can I get some Diablo sauce? In the back. Oh, perfect. Have you had these before? They're pretty good. The oh, cheesy they're roll so good. Dude. They're so good. I didn't even ask for the yellow sauce, so you put it in already. That's so sick. This is number four. <laughs> that time he looked like slightly amused. Okay. Like he looked like he was trying not to laugh a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Wait till we go through six more times. <laughs> <laughs> well, guys, looks like the sun is out again. It was snowing earlier and now everything's melted. The weather today is extremely bipolar. I guess it doesn't affect me because I'm in the car and the truck handled the snow perfectly. Life is good. 
really good. I'm sure he's probably wondering too, like, is this going to be the rest of his, the day? <laughs> or like, where's, what's our limit? <laughs> All right, can I get a uh, cheesy roll up with extra cheese and a side of beans, please? Hey, what up, you chicken with though? Sweet, thanks. I gotta say, his professionalism is on point. We gotta get him to crack. <laughs> <laughs> How many cheesy roll-ups can you order before they say no more? No more cheesy roll-ups. All right, thanks. Oh, mm. hoping sauce is in the bag. Yes, sauce is in the bag. Five more to go. He smiled this time. Before he was like not even talking. Now he's like, hey, hey here you go. So now <laughs> your turn. Okay. Uh, I also have two cheesy roll-ups. One of me chain. You're like trying to fumble. Like you can't grab the bag because your hands are full of cheesy roll-ups. This is the dumbest thing I've ever done. Oh yeah, slow cars. Whoa! Oh. We're about to pull up to the charger. I am very curious how long right it'll take to fill this vehicle up. The charger's full? Are you serious? It said on the app that no one was using the charger. Okay, that is kind of annoying about electric. What is that? Dude, it looks like pit stop from uh, cars. <laughs> <laughs> it's so tiny. You gotta get one. How much? More inconveniences in this vehicle. I'm at the second dealership now and there's no charger anywhere. We're gonna have to go to a different dealership just to charge this thing. I just need some gas or power or something. Talk about it. I'm gonna help you today. Hey man, could I do um, a cheesy roll up with extra cheese and then a side of beans, please? Thank you so much. Yeah, he's getting real good. He's, <laughs> he's getting, getting real good at the bunch. He, so. he didn't wait for him to punch it in. He just said, just pull up. Dude, I wonder if eventually he'll order, like, he'll be like, cheesy roll up when I pull up. That'd be the funniest thing. Oh, you should wait to see if he, like, prompts that. Have you eaten it before? I don't think so. This is my first cheesy roll up of the day. Thank you, man. See you later. See you in two minutes. He said something to us. <laughs> this time I'm just gonna say hello and see if he recognizes my voice. And if he doesn't, then I'll ask for the usual. <laughs> See if he remembers it. Hi, ho, welcome to Taco Bell. How can we help you today? Hey, man, how you doing? I'm doing pretty good. How about you, man? I'm doing good. Can I just do the usual, please? Cheesy roll of extra cheese and a side of beans. My man. Sounds good. What a sneak second window. <laughs> that was better than I was expecting. Is that a Kermit the Frog in front? What? Did they have a camera? How did he know it was me for sure? Because that's a crazy thing to do if it's a random guest. <laughs> it's the best. I love this guy. Man, at first, we had our doubts, but this guy is pulling through. He'll yeah. be a character. Hey, fellas. Hey. 230 net six for you. <laughs> Need the Yes, please. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you, man. What was your name? Oh, just call me Kermit. Kermit? <laughs> That's me. Thanks, Kermit. Have yeah. a good one. See you, you too. I love him. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. seven. So, so we have three more. Three more. Should I do a voice? All right. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Taco Bell. How can we help you today? What's going on, Kermit? I think you already know. Who's Kermit? It's Donald Schwarzenegger. <laughs> wait, 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 let me guess. A cheesy roll up with extra cheese and uh, side of beans and diablo sauce. Yes, yes, please. Sounds good. We'll have you taking window. <laughs> I'm crying. That's too good. I feel bad uh, that I have to admit this, but this guy at Taco Bell is one step ahead of us. <laughs> He's got new characters every time we're coming through. As, as the Taco Bell employee, we're the ones getting pranked. <laughs> Thank you. We have two more. Only two more, but he needs two more characters. <laughs> Arnold, Kermit, those are pretty good characters. I'm trying to think like who's like on the next tier of like, yeah, oh, every, everybody does this. Maybe Barack Obama or Donald Trump. Those are pretty good ones. Do Owen Wilson. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Cheesy roll up for you guys, huh? Wow, wow, didn't see that coming. <laughs> <laughs> this is the most fun I've ever had <laughs> in your life. <laughs> Hey, how are we doing today, cousins? Uh, good, man. Could I please do a, a cheesy roll-up with extra cheese and a side of beans, please? And applesauce? And applesauce, yes. Applesauce? We don't have applesauce. This is a Taco Bell. Uh, you uh, mean Diablo sauce? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Who is he? 
I think it's Arnold again. <laughs> is it Arnold and Corinne? <laughs> yeah. yeah, we're still pretending like every time we come through, it's the first time. All right, 236 for you. Thank you. Perfect. What was your name again? Uh, that's classified. <laughs> <laughs> He's a secret agent. Kermit. Is that for you? Oh, I'm so excited. Thank you, man. You too. I'm glad we only have one more. It's, it's gonna so be so. Uh, <laughs> oh God, dude. He doesn't even know who he is now. <laughs> or that's crash of mine. <laughs> All right, we're gonna see if we can fake him out. I don't see any cameras. Oh, there's a camera at the top of the menu. They see that it's us every time. Oh, we can't fake him out then. I was gonna do an accent. You can still do an accent. Which do one? An impression of someone. No, that's of Drew. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. I'll be Drew. <laughs> I'm Drew. <laughs> What do I do? Hello? What the heck? Can I get a cheesy roll up with extra cheese and um, side of beans, please? I hate this is going to be on the internet forever. You know it. Either that's a different person or he's really good at impressions. Oh <laughs> yeah, that's him. Dude, I feel like the whole restaurant knows about us now. Yeah. Yellow sauce in the bag. <laughs> uh, that was my coworker taking that order. I was in the bathroom. Uh, 236. It's Christian. Everybody calls me Christian. Christian? Nice yes, to meet you, Christian. You've been great. Hey, oh, wow. Uh, <laughs> What's your name? What's your name, man? Andrew. 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 Nice Isaac. Isaac. Nice to meet you, man. I think we're full, so this will probably do it for us. What's that? We're probably full. We are full. <laughs> We're full, so this will probably be our last roll-up. You've been great, great, Christian. Yeah, great. see ya. Appreciate you. Man, don't let me on public ever again. <laughs> so, I think the charger's in the front of the vehicle. Drew? Yeah? You're probably gonna have to do this. <laughs> you can't get out of the car? Yeah. If I were by myself, I would, I would obviously not be able to get out, but since Drew is here, there's no rule against camera guy helping. I wonder how Isaac and Andrew are gonna fill up their car. Oh, you're right. We're at the gas station. We picked this thing up. It didn't have a lot of gas. We gotta fill up, which is gonna be a challenge since we can't actually get out. Uh, what size is the gas? I don't tank? know. Which side is it on? Okay, hang on. Hold this. Uh, not, I don't know. see anything over here. I guess the pump is on this side, but I don't know where. I don't see it back there. But check this out. You go on the screen, click the car, and if you want to, the charge button, and look up here, I'm going to push it, and it's going to open the gas. Oh! Whoa. That's pretty cool. Yeah! How do we do this? <laughs> I think you just pl plug that in and then scan this car, the card. Oh, perfect. Uh, perfect. Did it work? I can't tell if it's charging or not. No, it's not charging. I'll go try again. We cannot figure out this charge. I guess we're gonna have to find a place later. Maybe at like a McDonald's or something because this isn't working. This is not good, Rivian. No way. That is like the best case scenario. What? It's right here? It's right here. No way. We don't even have to get out or climb across the back of the car. That's insane, actually. Easy reach. I was thinking getting gas, that would be like the ultimate challenge. Yeah. That is crazy. They put the gas tank right by the door. Bro, this is the best vehicle. Every challenge that I thought I was gonna have turned out to like be the easiest thing ever. Yeah. I don't know how Justin is gonna charge his. No, but I sure am glad I'm in here though. Yeah, why are you in here? It's sunny outside. And we don't need to talk about that because my car <laughs> can't drive when it's wet outside and it was snowing like nuts. Right? Yeah, but not anymore. Yeah, but <laughs> we're having so much fun in the van. <laughs> It'd be such a bummer to go back to the car. That's fair. I don't mind you staying. Okay. Let's go find Justin. <laughs> okay. We have just met up with Andrew and Isaac. We are backing up to Isaac's van. So that way Andrew and Isaac could get in the trunk of the Rivian. Oh, look at that. No way. Should I go across? <laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, oh, that's such a fun playground. <laughs> it's a party, guys. Come on back. This is luxurious. Yeah, it's nice in here. Got the lights on. It's a vibe in here. I think it's the perfect setting for a back of the van boxing match. I got these boxing gloves at Walmart. Uh, yeah, I kind of just decided Justin and Andrew were going to box. You yeah. just got to make that decision. Yeah. <laughs> the only rule in back van boxing is uh, full send oh. it. You have to stand on your knees on the couch. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just making up as I go. Like, make sure you protect your face and watch the back of your head. Oh, wait, 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 I'm nervous. What are the rules? How do we win? Yeah, we don't know what we're doing. Coach, normal coach. boxing rules. Yeah. 
<laughs> Normal rules. You either win by uh, decision, and I'm the judge, or you must. <laughs> <laughs> Ten rounds. No, I God. <laughs> No, three rounds. How freaking three, long? Three 30 second rounds. <laughs> First round starting now. Three, two, oh, one. What? <laughs> you can't say now. And then they In three, two, one, go. <laughs> <laughs> You're breaking with my head with your head! How do you do that? You're headbutting each other! Go back of the head shot! <laughs> That's illegal! Three, two, one, and break, break! Break! Collision! <laughs> First round complete, pretty close match. Not <laughs> winning so far. It's really hard to tell. A new rule added to back of the van boxing. You're not allowed to uh, have a 40 degree angle at the hips. What? So, <laughs> Please demonstrate the yes. So you can't be bent over. You have to be. What's 40 degrees to you? I said I said Such 90. A random. 40 degrees. degrees is I'm saying 90. You said 40. You cannot be 40 oh. degrees. At oh, the hips. I meant 90 degrees. It's basically to prevent too much leaning forward. And like what? accidental head butts. <laughs> yes. They, they hug in boxing. <laughs> yeah. You ever seen that? Fans of back of the van boxing want to see some clobbering, right, guys? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Oh, back through her. Oh, back of the head. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> you hunt yourself, you know? <laughs> this is 90. Rap 90. 90. 90. That's 90. Bad boy. You don't call it. <laughs> You're too slow. Sorry. The round's only 30 seconds. <laughs> Ready for round three? <laughs> the round just ended. <laughs> All right, final round. I want to see some good strikes. <laughs> okay. starting, starting positions. <laughs> what are that, starting positions? That's a good one. Whatever you want. <laughs> Wait, no, no, no. You can't copy me. What? Because then my face is exposed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it looks like Justin's striking first. Three, two, <laughs> one, go. Okay. Well, the results were hard to tell, especially since I got attacked in the last round. You guys comment who you think won. Me, Justin, or Andrew? <laughs> yeah, you included. You're the ref. <laughs> Isaac had this Papa shot, so we're gonna do a sick drive-by trick shot. I got you guys. Okay. I'm getting fired, guys. <laughs> Time for the drive-by trick shot. Dude, perfect. Wait, we thought of a better idea. Why doesn't one of us be in the trunk? It's a great idea, guys. Okay, I thought we were going the other way. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you gotta get a little bit closer to the right. <laughs> this is gonna take forever. <laughs> Okay. Barely. Yeah! What the? They were they were so close. He pretty much just could have dunked it. No, no, I can almost dunk that. I got my blaster. It's time for a surprise attack. Hey guys. Hey. I'm heading out. Got places to be, things to do. What is that? Oh! Ow! Oh. Oh. Man, this is lame. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> the thing's like barely shooting. <laughs> <laughs> Are you kidding me, Nerf Rival? This is pathetic. Nerf? Yes! <laughs> this is so dumb. I don't get it. What happened? That was lame. All right, well, on that note, goodbye. Goodbye. Bye. All right, we have a pretty insane idea. It's almost nighttime. We're going to pull off a DoorDash first... Uh, the first ever DoorDash delivery from the restaurant to the car. It's already at the restaurant. If that doesn't make sense, just keep watching. <laughs> so I'm placing the order right now. We're getting some crumble cookies. All from me though. Oh no, I'm having some. I feel uh, convicted buying you crumble cookie though. Because you have 
diabetes. <laughs> All right, so I put the address as the crumble cookie address, and the instructions are, we're in the silver van. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna be so confused. I did put a $20 tip on here, though, just for, you know, That's nice. niceness. We're here. We're literally parking right out front of the crumble. <laughs> this guy's gonna be so confused. I don't know how, I don't know what we're gonna say to him, because this is gonna be such a strange interaction. <laughs> We're literally like 10 feet from the door. We could have just grabbed it ourselves. Right. So he's going to be like, what are you guys doing? Now we wait. They're just yes. preparing. There's still one left, dude. How? Still good? <laughs> I'll get rid of that bit. That's the best part of having all these cheesy roll-ups is we can eat them throughout the day. I do love Taco Bell. I mean, who doesn't love Taco Bell? You know what be sick? Is if we had a hidden Taco Bell in our house. This is the door dasher. We are here, which means he is nearby. He's really close. Yeah. Is that the Dutch Bros? Oh, yeah, man. Is he getting coffee first? <laughs> if he's got Dutch Bros in his car, I'm on to you, Layton. Should I call him? Like, what are you doing at Dutch Bros? <laughs> <laughs> um, we didn't realize that they had like curbside pickup for Crumble Cookie. It literally <laughs> just says, tap I'm here on your Crumble app, and they come out and bring it to you. Oh, God, <laughs> we're done. <laughs> done. <laughs> Now we have Layton driving all the way around town. He's going the wrong way. <laughs> He's literally going in the apartment complex. He's going home. <laughs> he says, I'm not doing that. <laughs> Looks like he is almost here to the location. Isaac, keep your eyes peeled. He should be coming around that corner any second. He's going to park yeah, next to us. Because he's like sussed. Here, hold this. He just saw the silver van. Yeah. Wait, where'd he go? He's parking. He's backing into the handicap spot. Oh gosh, I'm nervous. Why? <laughs> Why do we keep doing this to ourselves? <laughs> oh, that's him. Oh, that's definitely him. He's probably gonna be so freaking confused. Yeah. <laughs> what the heck? We have to like make sure he. Oh, that's definitely him. He's picking up an order. What, what, what do we do? Oh, he's coming. He's gonna come. See, see if he comes to us. Wait, he's not. He's getting in the car. Where's he going? No, 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 no. no. Stay here. Wait, Layton. Load it on your what and say, Layton. Hurry. Uh, Layton. Oh. oh. No, no, no. He's Layton. leaving. Layton. <laughs> Oh, wait, wait. Well, now he's gonna check the his app and be like, wait, it says they're here. Why would they be parked out front of the store? He stopped over there. Should we follow him? No, because then the delivery location will be off. I can. Oh no, he's leaving. Should we gotta follow him? We should. We should have stopped him. I, I told you to yell at him. Oh. He was getting in the car. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Should we follow him? We have to. Layton, we're behind you in the van. Don't, Don't crash though. Don't crash. Okay, okay. Let's let's see if we can pull up next to him. Layton. Yeah, he's coming back. Dude, he's gonna pull up right next to us and get Oh it. yeah, perfect delivery. Oh, he's laughing! Yes, 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 yes. Layton! Thank you, man. Sorry, I was confused. Nah, yeah, it's pretty confusing. We just didn't feel like getting out of the car. Alright, cool, man. You have a good night. Appreciate it, man. You too. Dude, he's like, what? <laughs> Why are you opening the cookies? Those aren't even for you. I'm just looking at him. Oh. Stop driving. <laughs> that one's got a hole in it. It's, 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 it's a donut. You need to stop. Put the cookies down. Can I have a bite? You can have a bite. Holy man! Obviously, I'm not gonna eat all these cookies. I thought it'd be a good gesture. To maybe leave some at the office. Maybe someone wants a cookie tomorrow. And it says, I love you. So, editors, if you have a cookie, I love you. <laughs> I'm taking you somewhere special now. Huh? What does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be setting up my portable DVD movie theater back here. And I got a lovely movie. I'm gonna watch Shrek. Is this distracting as you drive? You're gonna give me another seizure. Another one? I, I've been known to have some. Well, I think you've probably figured out by now where the special place is. Yeah, this is looking very familiar. Since it's not snowy anymore, and the fans are probably thinking, man, ain't you such a wuss. Oh, yeah, they were all thinking that. <laughs> I knew it. You're dropping me back off of my car. <laughs> You're really going to kick me out after all the fun and the adventures we've had. I'm just saying, the fans want to see you sleep in that thing. But you can stay in here for the evening. You can watch a movie. That would be great. Tornado. I got to figure oh. out how to actually work that TV. And then I might need your help setting up my bed. <laughs> <laughs> what an odd request. <laughs> what was first, movie? I say we migrate to the back. Ah! No way, you just did that again. Oh, I hate this car. Just pay attention. The way I sit up is always like forward. <laughs>
not like this, like. <laughs> now we can turn off the lights and this is going to be insane. Oh my, dude, this feels like a luxury car now. Like the roof, you can see all the stars and everything. Yes! Oh, 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 you got it! I got the movie! Dude, the sound system in here is insane. This is basically like a mobile movie theater. Sharks and gators and all kinds of crap killing people in the streets. <laughs> you can't do that. You can just look a scene. It's illegal. <laughs> What? Well, yeah. this is a bizarre film. Okay. <laughs> the last time I'm unlocking this door. I'll say one thing: the Jace Two movie is gonna no. be ten times better than this. So. Oh, I promise. Like the cuts are actually gonna match when we edit them. Is that you, Gordon? How did you know? Enough! What are you doing in my house? I just remember, there's a secret tunnel back here, guys. I can't. Head can't fit through here. I'm in the tunnel though. You guys gotta come check this out. So I was considering sleeping in here, but it's actually extremely claust claustrophobic. What? Claustrophobic. But come in here. Oh, I can't even barely fit the camera. This is how much room there is, which is not a lot at all. But it is a pretty cool secret bonus hiding spot in this truck. I actually really like this about the Rivian. There's a lot of storage in here. You can put groceries, whatever you want. Like it's actually pretty roomy in here. Like I'm able to completely stretch out. Whoa, and there's a plug? Look at this. You can barely see that, but that's a plug. Right there. All right, I've had enough of Monster NATO. <laughs> <laughs> it's time to kick Andrew out. Oh man. Sorry, man. Get my stuff prepared in here because I won't have any room once I get into the back of this. I'm bringing the movies to the tailgate and the trunk here has custom lights in it. Check it. Oh yeah. This is still working. Making for complete vibes out here. Dude, the whole ceiling's lit up. That's cool. That's the line right there. <laughs> All right, I got my bed set up. I got this pretty nice heavy duvet because I wasn't sure if it was going to be cold tonight or not. And it honestly is pretty chilly. Since I'm not going to leave the heat on all night, it's good to have something nice and warm. Got a pillow. The owner said this back seat is supposed to go down, but I cannot figure it out. There's a lot of buttons that like don't do anything. And so I'm sure one of them is for this bed. I just can't figure it out. Having it fully flat is honestly probably not that much more space lengthwise, just width wise. So this is honestly pretty comfortable. Oh, ooh. man, this actually is nice. This is the comfiest car camping I've ever done. Man, this thing is luxury. I definitely got the best vehicle. My legs definitely, you know, <laughs> they're gonna be a little bunched up over here. Whoop. Oh crap. I highly doubt Andrew is gonna sleep very well, but I am living in luxury, guys. Now that I'm under the covers as well, it's super warm. The vibes as well from the lights. Let me go look at what Andrew's doing. What is going on? All I can see is a ton of tiny little lights. I know you can't see me, but I have some lights that I'm gonna set up to make it kind of more of a vibe in here. Aha! Wow, this is actually a really long light strand. Okay, just put the lights around, I suppose. Make it kind of nice. Oops. Oh. Go over the seat elbow. Obviously, not a lot of room in here. The seat is as far back as it goes. <coughs> so I can't even technically lay out. Well, maybe if I get my feet under the pedals there. <sighs> yeah, I feel like this technically could be worse. <laughs> my blankie, pillow. Oh, this might not fit. Oh gosh, the pillow is so big. This is gonna break my back. <laughs> Man. Hmm. If there's a way I can lay this way. I think this is good night. I'm about as comfortable as I'm gonna be. I'm assuming my back is gonna be sore as all get out in the morning. <laughs> well, guys, it's time for bed. I'm gonna try and get a good night's sleep. I'm assuming I will, because it's actually just pretty comfortable in here. I got the cool lights going. And just look at the ceiling, this is too cool. So, <sighs> good night everyone. Morning guys. It is uh, actually freezing in here. That was a pretty decent sleep. It is pretty cold in here now though, because the engine has been off for the whole night, but slept pretty good. I uh, wonder if I have any Mr. Beast chocolate for breakfast. Oh. Oh. No way. I actually do have one left. 
the way to start the day, right boys? Andrew's not actually here anymore. So I'm wondering where he is. I'll probably go back to the Conta house real quick and try and find him, see how it went for them. There's a lot of cars here at the Conta house. Who are those guys? What is going on here? Their cars are here, so they must be in the warehouse. Justin? Yes. Andrew? What are you doing? What are you making a movie? What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I just woke up in Walmart. Let's see what you're standing, typing. Cheers. Let's see if we can see both.